hi guys thank you for always stopping by on my youtube channel today i'm going to react to something really exciting family guy the darkest humor in family guy the last family guy was really funny and i can't wait to see what he has for us here but if you're yet to subscribe to this channel please do wait to hit the subscription button like my video share my video and also don't forget to drop your comment to help me connect with you better it helped me to know what you would like to see what you think about my video and i like it so let's get right into this reaction guys east coast welcome to the newest bull rider peter the kid <laughs> You know what I am back at the ranch? I'm a breeding bull. What, 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 what's that? You gonna find out. <gasps> Where you going, fatty? We gonna have a party. <laughs> what do you want, Griffin? Angela, look out your window. You see that Anheuser Busch billboard next to the children's hospital? Well, watch this. Oh, God. Oh, my God. This is horrible. Oh, God. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, good Lord. Save them. Bless their li Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Everything worked out. I got a house on this the Cape. Dark. Maybe you come visit. <laughs> Maybe. That isn't nice at all. Like, you did a thing and then you are pretending to be sorrowful about it. And then this is dark. <laughs> Dark humor indeed. Maybe you call a few days in advance to give me time to get the house clean. Okay. Maybe you bring a blazer so we can go to a wider range of restaurants. I'll, I'll bring a blazer. Okay, kids, we're going to start practice as soon as I get that guy out of here. I'm 60 yards away. <sighs> All right, I, I guess if a loose ball goes over there, just don't go. Careful who you get involved with romantically. Hello? I'm in the mood for some coitus. Get over here. I can't. I'm with my family. Pick up wine on the way. Well, Angela, if I'm really the only guy at work who can solve it, I'll be right there. Ah, it's ah. another pleasant day for me, Peter That's the irony. Strawberry. Hey, Mr. Worm. I welcome your arrival, because we're all part of the same garden. Wait, wait, what are you... Oh, hey, wait, hey. Hey, get out of here. Hey. Ah, 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 ah. He oh, was my God. neighbor, and he violated me. Now I'll never end up in a fancy pie. Coward! I have found you! Yeah! Oh my God, Stewie, you okay? Quick, somebody call an ambulance. This could need stitches. We don't want this to leave a scar. No, there's no time for an ambulance. We gotta take him to the hospital right away. Guys, I'm all right. I think Meg... Oh, my God, he's delirious. So he's talking nonsense. Dead. Quick, everybody in the car. What? It's my job. I lost my house. My wife left me for a bigger cock. You get five minutes to say goodbye to your father. <laughs> Sup, Bernie? Holy moly, oh that's a huge God. cock. Let's get this stuff out fast, guys. Oh These people God. have nothing. All right, everybody gets a hot dog toaster and a special zigzag brownie pan so that every brownie you bake has a chewy edge. We got 300,000 Harlequin costumes and 500,000 sets of stairs that a dog can use to get up on a bed. Well, looking around, I can see everybody looks kind of thirsty, so each of you gets a Crash Bandicoot video game. All right, I'll see you guys next month, because I got a shipment coming in of those realistic... You're testy and then you're getting a video game. Like, this is wicked. This is not funny, actually. Why am I even laughing? This isn't funny, but it's real, right? This is what happened in our world. Testicles you hang off the back of your truck. Lois, I know how many beers I can drink and still be able to drive. I figured it out. Seven. Six. Peter babysat for the neighbor's kid. All right, uh, I couldn't find your toys, so uh, why don't you just play with this blow dryer and these rattles? Well, guess that's it. Well, you probably want me to get out of your hair, so uh, here's to Drano in case there's a clog. Uh, soap's right there next to the radio, and towels are on the roof. So, uh, good night. Hey, on LeVar Burton's visor. Why would he wear these? Who would invent these for him? Listen, Tiffany, you seem really great, and I need to come clean with you about something, because... 
Well, if I don't, there's two guys who are going to tell you anyway. I have herpes. Really? Yeah. Well, that's okay. I mean, if we're careful about it, it shouldn't be an issue. And the truth is, I like you so much, I'd do anything to make this work. Oh my god, I'm so happy to hear that. I, I, I feel the same way. Oh, Tiffany, you know, you know, I know this is crazy and, like, super sudden, but... Will you... You're gonna die alone, you dick! I love playing the maracas. They're so fun. I wonder what's in them. Sand or rice, probably. Maybe it's little shells? Oh no, what if it's bones? No, no, bones are too big. But baby bones aren't! No, 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 nobody would kill a bunch of babies for maracas. How would you kill all those babies anyway? I'd probably put them in a tub. You could kill like eight at a time that way. Plus it softens them up so you can get the bones right out. Joe just had a baby. And I got a baby at home. I got a tub. Peter, you seem off today. Are you thinking about killing infants again? No. Now you gotta kill them, too. Michael Myers. If it seemed like he dead, he ain't dead. Boy, Peter, seems like that obedience school did wonders for Brian. Oh, yeah, it's great. He'll do anything I tell him to now. Maybe I should send Bonnie. <laughs> oh, 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 my. All right, somebody really? say something else. No. You need to know what you did. I want you to sign my chest. And I want to hock a loogie in your face. I want you to sign my ass. And I want to hock a loogie in your face. Whoa. I want you to autograph my stomach. Okay, fine, but do me a favor. Don't spit on my friend. Hey, Brian, why don't you mind your own business? It gets way up your nose. I want you to resist the urge to levitate off the ground and float towards the pie. Doesn't seem too hard. All right, go stand. I hope you know what I'm thinking. No way. Over there. Ha <laughs> no you don't. No, no, you can't go in there. No, no, stay out of there. That's my special area. Ah, 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 no, stop. I'm saying no. Ah, what kind no. of pie is this? Peter, it's making me watch. Pete's sake, which has caused outrage with a misogynistic comic. Here's a video of some outrage. Yeah, those boos don't hurt so much because you spent two minutes of the last segment applauding a red velvet cake. And if that's not bad enough, this morning's cartoon is even worse. Let's put that up. News: There was a hit and run by a drunk driver today at Quahog Park. Two children are missing. <gasps> I was just there. Come on, come on in. Your family's waiting in here. There are toys and a puppy and food that's not served from warming trays. <laughs> Come on, you gotta want it. Oh, you gotta do better than that. Okay, I guess you don't want a new family, toys, and a puppy. He has you die for rings? Well, this is like that, except it's a pill, and it's not okay if you don't get it. Ah, damn you! <laughs> oh, come on, you just touched it! What's all the yelling? Oh my god, Lois, what are you doing? <laughs> First, there wasn't enough. Mr. Griffin, do you really think this is an appropriate cartoon to run on Gloria Steinem's half-birthday? You sound angry. Did one of your friends get engaged? You have no idea how offensive you are to women, do you? What? I love women. I bet I can name more porn stars than you. But, but don't tell my wife how many porn stars I know. I'll get in a lot of trouble. I know all of them, though. There are people who just started an hour ago, and I know them. <laughs> it worked! Gracias. What are my powers? Oh, yeah, it's weird. You're, like, really good at painting my living room. Up, up, and get it done by Saturday. We're having a party. You can't leave him alone. Come on, it's good to have some alone time. You know, I spent a year alone on a desert island with nothing but a monkey to keep me company. You're saved, sir. We're gonna get you back to civilization. And how about we bring along your monkey pal? Okay. Yeah, we can teach him sign language, and he can tell us stories about what you two did on the island together. No, 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 let's, let's not, let's not bring the monkey. 
I can't dissect this pig, Mr. Chingman. It's against my religion. Believe me, Neil, it's no thrill for the pig to touch a Jew, either. Hey, kid, get in my van and I'll give you some candy. Oh, no, my mom says I shouldn't. <laughs> hey, kid, get in my van and I'll give you some candy. Okay. Specials, but first, I need to tell you, I'm gay. The hell you are! No waiter of mine is gonna be gay! He's the only waiter we have! Lois, our waiter is dead to us. We have to focus all our attention on our hostess now. <laughs> I love you, She-Hulk. All right, son, I'm gonna need those two hams back. I don't have any hams. Lift up your shirt, son. I need an adult! I need an adult! You're not a shoplifter. You're just a fat kid. Huh. Sorry about that, fatty, fat, fatty. Hey, Tom, he's just a fat kid. Aren't you, fatty? He's just a big old fat kid. Here's some chocolate, okay. fatto. Some things are actually exposed in this um, clip. It's kind of a joke, and it seems kind of dark, but at the same time, most things in here are happening, but it's just hard to believe. <laughs> most things in here, actually, are not things people want to say in public, people want to talk about. But the reality of it is that most things in here is actually happening. When that man was talking that well, <laughs> was trying to defend himself not to be misogynistic <laughs> in quotes. And he was then talking about how lot he knows. And she was listening. I mean, anything for the women is crazy. This world is really fast turning into what we really cannot identify, what we really cannot say. And it's crazy. It's really dark. It's getting darker by the day. Darker by the day. Alright, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for watching this video with me up to the end. I really appreciate it. Thank you and see you in my next video. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Bye!